Hey guys, and welcome back to Urban Strike. When we last left off, we made it to San Francisco, and this mission is a bit of a doozy. It can actually be pretty bloody hard if you're not careful, but luckily, we should be okay. Let's continue. Idiots! If one pilot could take out those troops, I didn't want them anyway. <laughs> that well-designed weaponry is the only thing that I will miss, of course. I still have more. You should remember Malone. Malone's purchase of Alcatraz and the presidential military base in the late 90s put his army in a prime position to take out San Francisco. <laughs> Strategy tells us he plans to cut off the city by destroying the Bay and Golden Gate Bridge. Check them for bombs and neutralize ASAP. Informants have told us he is uh, completing work on a new laser weapon in his high-tech labs. Blast these labs in Golden Gate Park and destroy the laser weapon prototypes inside. Then destroy Malone's communication center, West Coast corporate offices and tank depot. Intelligence notes that one of Malone's generals is on site. Neutralize him before going on. Finally, secure a landing zone on Alcatraz. Land and enter the prison. Oh yeah. <clears throat> One of our top pilots, Long Haul, has been captured and is being held prisoner in a maximum security prison. Get past Malone's prison guards and security systems and break Long Haul out of there. Boy, with a laundry list like this. I'm glad you got me this watchcom. <laughs> sounds so futuristic, doesn't it? Watchcom. Yes, uh, it sounds like there's a lot to do on this mission, but there kind of isn't. As you can see... Our timer gauge is already ticking down, so we need to get a severe wiggle on. Now, I remember when I used to play this game as a kid, I used to think that um, this area was covered in snow. It was really confusing. But a comment, actually, on my previous LP of this actually mentioned that this is supposed to be fog. Apparently, it's quite common in San Francisco. Which, uh, okay, cool. I mean, I didn't know that because, uh, hey, I don't live in San Francisco. I live in Pasty Land. So our first mission is to destroy bombs on Bay and Golden Gate Bridges. Protect the Bay and Golden Gate Bridges from the bombs, shooting the bombs to dislodge them. Yeah, that seems safe, but sure. We're going to shoot off some bombs uh, from the bridge. Now, testing this mission, just flying up to this, uh, I did get a random game over. Uh, return to base and whoa we've taken a lot of damage from that guy holy shit he really got the drop on us these things are weird and pretty useless but we don't really want to trifle with them if we don't have to um these are af 484 hover choppers apparently but if we look here it's the wrong model i don't know if that's because of the rom i'm using to to play this or what um, I don't know. <laughs> I can't be bothered, to be honest, to dig my Mega Drive and cartridge out to check. But there we go. AF487 Hover Chopper. Armor 200, power 10. So they're very weak, but you can see how quickly they fire at you. It uses a um, transom-mounted propeller. Is that meant to be a tandem-mounted propeller? And steers like a dream. An ideal subsonic urban air vehicle recently designed by a little old terrorist. This little old terrorist is pretty smart, let's be fair. Now, Land Shark. Um, these things suck. They've got 300 points of armor and do 40 damage to you. Street smart urban assault tank. Low slung and well armored. Hard to hit, harder to hurt. Yeah, they're really nasty. And then we've got the armadillos. Crunchy on the outside, soft on the inside. Um, they are 250 points of armor and 50 damage. Armored like a manhole cover, so bring your can opener. Carries surface-to-air missiles. Yeah, these things really sting. And there's lots of them. There's lots of land sharks too. And lots of these hover choppers as well. And of course, we've got the flat cannons, which we've had before. They're nothing really to worry about. Um, right, let's get a wiggle on. Anyway, now this guy we want to kill. Because he has an extra life in him. I don't think there's a quick winch on this level. If there is, I haven't found it. Uh, there is... Two extra lives, though. And I do know where they are. 
We need to be pretty careful with equipment um, or shooting <laughs> in this level because it's very easy to destroy um, your equipment. Now, also, there is a few armor repairs dotted around. There's not many, but I know where a few are. These are pretty essential because there's a lot of equipment that you have to destroy on this mission. They throw a lot at you. There's mission one complete. And of course, we are going for our clean sweep. So we need to destroy everything. Right, our armor is 410, which is not great. I'm not going to lie. We've got plenty of fuel. So, second mission. Destroy Malone's radio tower. Destroy Malone's radio tower to stop the transmission of your location. Well, that seems like a bloody smart move. You jackass. Get out of here. Oh, God. We're just bumping into these things left and right, aren't we? 300 armor. Uh, yeah. Let's go scoop that armor up. Didn't really want to use it this early, but um, if we have to fall back on using lives, then so be it. There, we are going to have five lives on this mission, so uh, it's not the end of the world. And you're going down as well, me mate. Now, there's some civilian ve um, vehicles, some civilian buildings that you probably get frowned at for destroying, but they contain some good supplies, so we are going to be destroying some of them. Uh, hello? There we go. They sound like ducks. Ooh. Might seem a bit silly opening up these land sharks, but there's three land sharks, one on each of these grey areas here. Uh, there's two left, you can see. They each have an item in it. Fuel, ammo, and an armour repair. So use that to your advantage. Your best weapon in this game is knowledge, <laughs> knowing where everything is. And uh, I've, I've come pretty much prepared this LP. So, these are civilian buildings. There's not a lot in these. Uh, sometimes there are some enemies. Elvis is in one of them. Um, Elvis is actually on this level. There he is. So, we're actually getting in trouble for destroying these. But we're also getting some stuff. Oh, God. Yeah, he's done. But yes, there are goodies, and we want the goodies. As you can see, there really ain't a lot. I think there's ammo in one of these somewhere. I'm sure. Oh, maybe not. We're getting a little bit low on the old go juice by now as well, I would imagine. Get out of here. All right, well, maybe there wasn't. Oh, shit, we're out of fuel. Almost. Fuel drums will become a problem. Um actually which is not good whoa got some dude in there firing at us as well couldn't even see him damn but right you're gone get out of here yeah they they really don't take much to kill at all but i mean if you think about it the enemies did get a lot tougher in this one in jungle strike and uh, desert strike the enemies that we fight didn't have as much health as they have in this game. They've got lots of health, and there's lots of them. But this game is definitely easier. I'm not really sure why. I think it's the lack of alert zones, but we're already like out of armor just about again as well, which is not great. So we're going to have to be a little bit careful. So next mission, destroy Malone's West Coast Corporate HQ. Destroy Malone's five corporate HQ buildings. This will affect... his ability to command his armies in one second guys okay and we're back right yeah effect to command his armies in the city yeah uh i couldn't see my obs screen there so i was like oh shit are we recording we should be oh god we're out of weapons uh not good not good trouble with the good co-pilots is you really start running out of weapons fast what have you got? You've got armor. Okay, that's cool. That's cool, and I appreciate that. You know, it's pretty good of you, but we need uh, weapons. Please. So let's head back to base, pick up some ammo. Now, base here don't, doesn't even have fuel drums, I don't think. Maybe it does. Uh, no, our base doesn't even have freaking fuel drums, man. I mean, what's all that about? 
that's uh, not fantastic. We don't actually want to circle around and come from the north on these these guys. A little bit anyway. Yeah, north. North-ish. Because that's the way their guns are pointed. So hopefully most of their guns will now hit the building. Yeah. So they'll actually help us take the building out. Cheers, buddy. You're gone. Now they are going to protect these guys with air power. Because of course they are. Alright, get out of here. This mission's not actually that bad. Ooh. We are starting to get low on armor. Starting to get low. Hopefully we're not going to ram every single building we see like we did in the... Uh, Original video, uh, last video. Original video? Right. How many? There's a land shark there, and we've got another hover dude up here. Let's waste this guy. Two missiles, and he is done, son. All right. Yeah, you can see, because we've killed him, another one's actually spawned. Uh, there does only appear to be a certain amount of these guys on the map at once. And as you kill them off, more do spawn which is kind of annoying right let's go tag this guy anyway where is he ah oh, yeah ah oh, no 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 right he's finished he's got ammo we don't need ammo that hover chopper should be here but it's not very strange okay not sure what that's about. Let's go grab some uh, armor anyway. Yeah, we've got 80 points of armor left. So one fart in this thing and we're scratched. Okay, let's get out of it. Now, hey, what's all that about, mate? Now, our next mission, if we choose to accept it, and we are because we have to, is wipe out a Presidito tank deport or depot. Um, destroy the presidential, I don't know why my brain just says presidential, but hey, we'll roll with it. Tank depot. Blast all of the tanks and buildings. Be on the lookout for advanced smart bomb weapons that you can use. Yes, now, these um, <clears throat> advanced smart bombs, uh, yeah, we'll grab some fuel, that we can use are a mixed bag. If you're not careful... These advanced smart bombs will destroy you as well. Uh, yeah, not not necessarily a great pick, to be honest. Whoa, that sneaky fuck can fire over the building. Not happy with that. And really, dude, you're just going to try and light me up there? All right, cool. Cool, man. That's cool. These armadillo things are rough as rats. But that's okay. Because we're pretty fucking armed to the teeth ourselves. Yeah, they're nasty. They really are. Not an awful lot of good stuff in these buildings, sadly. What we like. We've got zero missiles. But we do have... Rockets. Now, we're going to need missiles in a minute. You better believe it. You better believe your sweet ass we're going to need missiles. Because where we're going, there's more enemies than, I don't know, grains of sand on a beach trust me right let's waste that and there should be another life there lovely and we're gonna pick up this ammo as well sure okay not bad um making some solid progress but if we come down here you'll see about seven hundred and fifty-eight thousand of our friendly armored tanks armadillos so we're gonna sneak in and try and use one of these. Now, if you do not get out of there quick, that will destroy you. It doesn't matter how much armor you have. It is a one kind of hit game over deal. It's not fun. And they're quite hard to accurately drop as well. But that's fine. We've got one left. We might as well use it, I guess. What's our armor like? <laughs> not actually very good but cool there is armor here somewhere i think there we go i like the way it says smart bomb detonated but actually 
we have not detonated the smart bomb. Please don't wake up. Cool. I actually vaguely remember being able to get in one of these. Oh god, that hurts. Yeah, that really stung. Holy shit. Alright. This is not going fantastic, to be honest. I know one of these has some goodies for us. I'm sure. Ammo. Well, we don't want ammo. Oh, man. Uh, oh, you've got armor. I'm sure of it. Yes. Yes. Right, we'll have that. And as luck would have it, we've got some fuel down here too. Very nice. I'll have him too. Right, what's left here? We're pretty much out of weapons, which is, well, not brilliant. Is there not any more vehicles around here? Fuel drum. There's fuel drums there, which is nice. Wait. We got all the armadillos. Sick, man. Happy with that. All right, well. On to the next mission, the Micron Lab. So, Micronetics High Tech Research Center in Golden Gate. Destroy Malone's Research Center, where it is complete, where he is completing work on his laser weapons. Blast the labs and destroy any weapon prototypes inside. Yeah, this one's not too bad. The only problem with this one is we've got land sharks to contend with. This is our first actual proper introduction to land sharks and yeah they hurt they hurt but luckily we have hellfires hellfires hurt more oh jesus comes right out of nowhere and blindsides us oh jeez man yeah he's done and we've got another one just down there oh evasive Armor is already cut in half. Oof. Okay, good thing we got the firepower to deal with this. Holy crap. Just sneaking up on me like that, huh? Not even gonna kiss me first. Jesus. Oof, that was painful. Okay. Good, good, good. And there's one of the lasers. Okay. Wow, look how much our armor has been shredded. Got a feeling there's going to be another sneaky boy. Yep. Now, mission five finished. That mission is a little bit naughty, if you ask me. Um, do we have any more land sharks? We don't, actually. That's cool. Um, right. We don't have any armor either, really. Uh, no, no we don't. There is another armor repair, but our next mission anyway is home base. Home base being attacked. Home base being attacked. Home base is being attacked? Okay. Your landing zone is under attack. Secure the LZ building by clearing it of all enemy forces. Now luckily, um, the only thing they've attacked it with is those ho hovercopters. That was a mouthful. Which aren't too bad on their own. They don't do a lot of damage. I mean, don't get me wrong. They're bad enough. But we should more or less be able to handle them. Wouldn't it be cool if we got to fly one of these? I think so. Uh, ooh. We're really low on the old weapon skis. Okay. Oh. Yeah. No matter how advanced you are, we're more advanced. Now, henchman. Stop Malone's right-hand man from escaping. Okay, this is actually fairly easy. He's just riding in this Ferrari type thing. And we can just shred him. Oh, God. Okay, that went okay. I think we're going to go down. We need weapons. We need weapons. Stat. Uh, shit. I'm trying to think if I know of any... 
Uh, any more armor? I do know of armor. I know of one armor, but it's guarded. I wonder if we can sneak in and grab it. Maybe. Maybe we can. Uh oh. Yep. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Not going to go down without a fight. Oh, and we destroyed the ammo too. Oh, no. Everything that could go did go wrong. Shit. Okay, well, you know, hey. Woohoo! That would have <laughs> that would have sucked, wouldn't it? Him lighting our ass up. Uh oh, hello. Oh no. Humiliation. Oh, that was embarrassing, wasn't it? Literally just got sniped. I was hoping down here there was gonna be some uh, armor, but hey, I guess not. You know, losing one life, I'm fine with that. Really? You just took three missiles, sir. Three. You're only supposed to take... No, yes. You took more than three. You're supposed to take 300 points of damage. You greedy little bastard. Right, fuel... You know, we'll scoop up the fuel also here as well. Uh, there's fuel there, but we'll take the fuel that's furthest away. Because we is smart, yo. And pretty consistent. We're almost at the end of this mission. So what we're going to do... Let's clean sweep this area before we move on. We're going to make sure we destroy all of these enemy uh, fighters. Because fuck those guys, quite frankly. Yes, he's had enough. Now you've got to be careful. See what I mean? We destroy one and another one spawns. Got to be very careful of that with these. Because I think there's X amount of these guys that are supposed to... Oh God, spawn around the bridge. Hey, dude, you weren't even, like, looking at me. I demand more respect than that. Look me in the face as I hose you down with my stream of justice. Or something. Whoa, who's letting off rockets? Oh, who the hell do you think you are? Honestly. Jesus. Okay, that's cool. Right. Oh, there you are. Oh, man, most of that missed. How did that miss? You know, Mr. Malone, sir, if you actually equip these guys with better weapons, maybe they might have been more of a threat. I'm just saying. Right, so that's all of those gone. That's all of the land sharks gone as well. Or at least all of the land sharks that we know about now, which I think is actually all of them. Uh, yes. We'll scoop that up. Now, that's pretty much it, guys. Now, next thing. So, the henchmen... We'll stop Malone's right-hand man from escaping. Silence Malone's henchman. He will try to run for it, but take him out before he can escape to warn the other cult leaders. Cult leaders? Okay. Take over Alcatraz. Secure the landing zone and land at Alcatraz. Clear the guard towers, then enter the prison. We can do that. We can do that. So let's go and take a little visit a little peek at the rock, shall we? Now, this place isn't that badly armoured, to be honest. Or armed, I should say. Let's take out the lighthouse. This is where Sean Connery escaped from all those years ago. A film called The Rock. One of my favourites for years. Loved that film. Oh, man. That was left-handed. Right. Not bad. We're just going to continue melting everything here. There's actually a good amount of equipment here, considering... Ooh, God. Face slap. Is it me or is it easier to hit stuff? Bump into things in this version. There's armor in here. But we're like literally right at the end of the mission now. So it don't really matter to be honest. Right, you're gone. Oh, maybe it does because we're on 160 armor. Yeah, maybe it does matter. <laughs> Damn, right. There should be two more... Of these hover jet majubrits that spawn, but that's fine. We can go waste these things. Oh, hey, sir. Hey, get out of here. And with that, that is this mission finished. Uh, the only thing left to do is to land and uh, invade this thing on foot. But that will wait for another video, guys. Let's might as well land, I suppose. Yes, this mission. Ugh, this mission. Do not like. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. When we come back, we're going to run through Alcatraz on foot. Ugh, 
live out many childhood fantasies or something. So thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time. 